What's up guys, Mojo Cakes here back with another video. Today I'll be telling you guys how to cop the new Amaneer Jordan 3 on Nike sneakers. Let's get right into it. So the Amaneer Jordan 3 will be releasing for a second time on Nike sneakers on June 10th. The shoe will be retailing for 200 US dollars and will only be releasing on Nike sneakers at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So this shoe did release, I believe sometime in April on Amaneer's website. And that was the first drop that we did get of the shoe. So if you didn't manage to cop, you are gonna be getting a second chance here on Nike sneakers. From the release we saw on Alma Meniere's website, a lot of people managed to get their hands on a pair and resale still is pretty decent for a shoe that was pretty widely available. The Alma Meniere Jordan 3 will be releasing in adult sizing. So that is woman sizing and men's sizing. And I don't believe that it is gonna be coming in extended woman sizing. This shoe will also be coming out in little kid sizing, which will be retailing for 90 US dollars. And lastly, the shoe will be coming out in toddler sizing, which has a retail price of $70. So no GS sizing for the shoe as they didn't make any GS sizing for the shoe, even for the release on Amma Meniere's website. So if you don't know who Amma Meniere is, they are an Atlanta-based sneaker boutique who teamed up with Nike to make a Jordan 3 collab. They have teamed up with Nike to make some other shoes in the past, but I don't believe they've made a Jordan 3 at all. So this is their first time uh, working on the Jordan model, I believe. The Jordan 3 Amma Meniere is dressed in a white, medium gray, and violet or color scheme. This woman's Air Jordan 3 features a combination of white tumbled leather, gray suede, and other premium materials. The shoe also comes with a vintage aesthetic with the yellow midsole and eyelets, quilted lining, and co-branding on the tongues completes the overall design. Now, a lot of people will already have their hands on a pair, or even if you didn't manage to get your hands on a pair on the first release, you can either double up or grab your first pair here on Nike sneakers. Now, the quality on the shoe is really, really good. It's very premium, as they mentioned, and a lot of people who already own their pairs seem pretty satisfied. Now, resale currently on the Amma Meniere Jordan 3 is anywhere from 350 to 600, and some sizes even going beyond that. And last sales on StockX being around the 350 to 500 $30 price range. Keep in mind, all these resale prices are in Canadian. Now, I do think after the sneakers release, the resale value will come down probably around $350 to $400. Before the Amma Meniere release, which was the official release of the shoe, the shoe was up there in the $700, $800 price range and some sizes even hitting $1,000. The shoe has definitely dropped and kept on dropping after the release. And I believe the resale value is still decreasing. But like I mentioned, after the sneakers release, I believe the shoe will come down to around $350, $400, probably around that kind of price range, depending on how limited or widely available the shoe is that really does affect the resale value. So if it is very limited and not a lot of people manage to get their hands on a pair, then the resale value will probably be around the $350 to $415 price range. Maybe some size even hitting $500. But if it is widely available and we see a lot of Ws on that day, then I think the price will come down to around the $350 to $400 price range. I don't see the shoe going near retail or even close to retail. You will be making profit on the shoe no matter what, at least $100 to $200 profit for sure. Now, I did forget to mention about the Amma Meniere Jordan 3 comes in this kind of special edition box. It does come with a sleeve over top of the actual box, which does feature the A Amma Meniere logo. The box itself does have a white lid with the bottom part being in this light kind of smoke gray. The top of the white lid does feature the Jumpman logo and a black colorway, and it does feature the word flight in this kind of cursive lettering. It was definitely a really cool box. I think they presented it very well. Now on June 10th, the shoes aren't the only thing that's going to be dropping. We will be seeing the full collection of clothing that did release on Amma Meniere's website as well. That will be dropping on Sneakers website at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on June 10th as well. So the first piece of clothing, we will be getting the flight jacket, which will be reselling for 200 US dollars. We will also be getting the fleece pullover hoodie, which is set at a retail price of 120 bucks. We also have the short sleeve tee in the gray colorway, which does have a retail price of $50. Next, we have the short sleeve tee in the violet or colorway, and that is also set at a $50 price range. We also have the long sleeve tee in the gray colorway, also set at $50, and the violet or long sleeve tee, which is also set at $50. The last long sleeve tee we do have is in the cream or natural colorway, and that is also set at $50. Now, moving on to the pants, we do have the woven cargo pants. Those are set at $150. Now, the last item of the whole collection is the diamond shorts, which do feature this really cool Ama Meniere logo design on them that you can barely see from far away, but in the close-up pictures, you can see and notice that design. These shorts are set at a retail price of 90 US dollars. So a pretty cool collection of clothing if you wanna grab some clothing, if you have the shoes to match, or even if you just like the clothing, even if you don't have the shoes, I think they do have a really cool collection and some cool pieces in there for sure. But make sure to let me know down in the comments what your guys' thoughts are on Amma Meniere and Jordan releasing the Amma Meniere Jordan 3 on Nike sneakers for a second chance. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching today's video. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like down below and consider subscribing to the channel. But as always, guys, stay safe and I'll catch you in the next video.